Welcome back everybody. So today we're actually going to be doing a recreation of a look that I did a couple weeks ago. Can you scratch that? Actually, I'm going to do this new look that I just saw. It's just like a liner look that kind of goes in and it's really, really nude. So we're just going to do that now. Let me see if I can show you guys what it looks like. I actually really dig it. I saw it on Anastasia Beverly Hills and I was like, it's a look, sis. It's a look, look. So it kind of just looks like that. Can you guys see? Oh, I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, so it kind of just looks like that, you guys. So this is the look I want to do. I just think it looks so pretty. Like, I'm like a little Egyptian queen looking energy. All right, so first things first, we're actually going to do our base just because it's just a liner look. It's very simple. So I'm going to start with my base and kind of go from there. Obviously, you guys, always the Artistry uh, Beauty Balm with SPF. You guys, that's why my face always looks gray because this stuff is has SPF in it. And, you know, <laughs> but guess what? No flashback bit. <laughs> You guys, this stuff, like, your makeup goes nowhere with this stuff. Like, it goes nowhere. This is my kind of primer. I like when a primer is obvious when I don't wear it. It's always obvious when I don't wear it. Just, I just look crazy. So, I just buff that in. What you done to me? You don't want me to me to an artist. I'm on a lizard. Okay, so I'm actually going to do my... Um, I'm going to conceal my eyebrows because I just realized I've got to conceal them because I already low-key did them. <laughs> well, I just kind of did mascara, brown mascara and black mascara. So now I'm just going to conceal them quickly. Nothing crazy. Remember how I said in my last video my eyebrows are going to start going out now? It's a vibe. It's trust. So next we're going to take our LA Girl Pro Foundation in Ebony. Low key I could probably uh, mix, oh no this is espresso, I could probably mix espresso with Ebony but this one is like just much warmer but I really do like Ebony because it's a lot darker and I prefer my base darker because my concealer is pretty light, my powder is pretty light so you know it kind of would help kind of balance everything out. So. If I had to choose, I would like a mixture of the two, but I can't choose, so I just picked the lighter one just because whatever, right? But I, I honestly, like, I've been thinking about it. I actually might go back to the other one. I'm going to spray my face before we continue real quick. The way I need more face spray, like, I just can't. Like, I'm getting bothered. So that was just the Cucumber 3-in-1 Primer Water by Wet n Wild Photo Focus. It smells disgusting. <laughs> In case anybody wants to know. Anyway, I go, I wanna be. Oh, I get your feel of my pants. Let's have a good time. Baby, I'm gonna make you swear. Let's have a good time. Baby, I'm gonna make you swear. Beautiful. Now that our foundation is complete, mm. now we take the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Toast. It's very, it's a lot warmer. I wanted a uh, fawn because it's yellower, so I could just use less of it, but this will do. So I'm just going to do not too much, but I'm going to really just focus on the high points of my face. Let's go here. Me na pillow one, say she give me feel one. Say let me the real one, say she give me feel my one. Aye, my one, say she give me for me your sit. Enter the radar, now you dey mash up the place. Enter the radar. I'm just gonna take my foundation brush again. I'm just gonna actually blend it out. Anyway, I go, I wanna be. Anyway, I go, I wanna be. Having a monitor, you all need to get one. Like, that's just how I'm feeling. Get an HDMI cord, get an old TV that no one uses in the house, plug your issue in. Trust and believe me. It's like the most underrated thing I've ever done for myself is get one of these. 
In a yard, say she give me in a yard ah. Man a wine, say she give me dirty wine Man a grind Man a bad, man a boss in a the thing so So I'm actually gonna do something different that I don't normally do I'm actually gonna set my face first Usually I just set I'm actually just not gonna set my under I'm gonna set my whole face With my um Artistry translucent powder in Dark Yeah I know, it's the darkest color they have But that's okay We ain't even mad at them so I'm just going to take a fluffy brush and I'm actually just going to take a little bit of that, dust a little bit away in here, and I'm just going to tap into my skin. Just to give me like a really nice flawless look, I feel like doing this kind of really makes you look really matte, <laughs> one, and just very flawless. It gives you a blank canvas, so then when you want to do your you can see, no, concealer, sorry, contour, your bronzer, blush, it kind of just gives you a really nice base. I'm just going to lightly be setting this area. Usually I do like the big, like I use the little sponge and I really hit in there in the high points, but I'm like today, let's see if we just set our face. Mmm, we love a good base, guys. A good base is the way of life. We love a good bang. Look at that. Once you're all one color, you guys, this stuff is magic. Everybody should get some of this. So once you really fill up that base, we're gonna contour our face now. Honestly, take any brown eyeshadow, dark colored shadow that you have and contour your face. I'm using the It's My Ray Ray palette, guys. It's just this old ass palette. It's just like this dark, 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 dark brown here in the corner. It's basically done though. Okay. After that, we're gonna contour our nose with the same shade. I'm gonna lightly contour here. Then I can put my nose ring in because once the nose is contoured, we back at it, baby. We back at it. I'm gonna fix my eyebrows quickly. I'm gonna take actually a black pencil. Baby, I go die for your matter. Okay, so we're gonna basically start with setting our eyes with a very muted tone, which is we're in the perfect palette. Shout out to It's Already, she really did that. So I'm actually gonna use this this shade here, put that all over my lid. Perfect. We're gonna do an, a line so that we can bring it in, okay? So I'm just gonna take my Maybelline Black is Black Studio Pot Liner with my really sharp little. <laughs> Like that. Oh, we rocking with it. So let's do the next eye. Hopefully we can do it just as good. Always put your hand somewhere on your face. I usually put it near my, near my contour because the makeup comes off. At least it's a dark area. And then you just kind of go up again. No, you speed it, flick a this one's a little more smudged. I'm actually just going to clean that up with a little bit of. Actually, let me use my finger. I'm pretty sure I can. I won't lie to you 
you guys, I kind of love the way it looks though. So I'm just gonna force this one too. <sighs> I'm now going to just smudge out the top area. After I first, I'm just gonna cut, I'm just gonna add some more here just to make sure it's clean. Cause I'm about to put some black in that area anyways. So really set it and make sure it's ready. So I'm gonna take a nice warm shade before I do super dark shade. So let's go to the Jackie Iron palette just cause shocker best palette of the game. Um so let's take let's take edges. No, let's take credit. I'm gonna take credit. I'm just actually gonna smudge right above that line. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, so I'm just gonna blend like so. We're gonna go in and clean this out later, but same thing on this side. Now we take a fluffier brush and I'm just going to blend. Okay, I'm going to take the same pencil brush and I'm just going to fix up the line there just to make it really strong. So I'm going to attach the bottom and the top there, just because I'm going to smoke it out anyways. So you might as well make it a straight line, just to really make it easy for yourself later. A, just a regular pencil brush like this, and put water, we're going to do black in our water line. Baby, show me love, love I'm gonna take now the lighter shade and I'm actually gonna put the banana shade in the actual in, on my crease. You go crazy, you make you look flashy all the days of the week. Uh, always gonna be loving you, you know I never stop. A beauty queen, yes, you fly like ivory, one in a mill, a la bar can pirate. Okay, now we're gonna do liner on top. Isn't it lit? It's a liner frenzy out here. Same brush, obviously. Same liner. It's not gonna be anything. It's gonna be really a thin line, just to really connect the top and the bottom. Now I'm going to do my lip color. I'm going to start with a little bit of brown liner. Then I'm actually going to take a warmer lip pencil. A little bit of pink. Okay, 
Okay, spare face. Top guy. Alright, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I really rock him with this look. This might have to be a look I wear every single time I leave the house for the next week or so. Because this is a look. I'm really digging the like the space in between. Like it's really wow, it's really forcing the sultry eye look, and I'm kind of rocking with it. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys so much. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm feeling myself. <laughs> Girls come, but you are too fly. You are so nice, you are too shy. Shady girl, girl, that is so killing. And anytime you come around, you know I catch feelings, man. Shady. Thank you guys so much for watching. And of course, I'll catch you guys next time. I know. And what they hate more, I could be someone you can sleep.